Good. Hello. Hey, hey, dudes. So listen, you were wanting to know what the routine was. This is called the Britain. The Britain routine. So I'm going to show you. It's Sunday, the 30th of March, about 10.30 in the morning. And it's going to take you about, uh, it's going to take about seven, eight minutes. So what it is, you have to decide how many, how many repetitions you want to do first. And once you got that, then you just do it. So, but I, here's what it is. So I'm going to do a three, so, so it goes quick. So I, I do this, I pull up my leg, stretch a little bit, three seconds. So one, two, three. And then I do this one on the other side. One, two, three. And then I come over and I do the back of the leg. One, two, three. And the other back of the other leg. One, two, three. And then I put a, a knee up. And I go like this. One, two, and three. You get the ID. See how it works? Very simple. You know? And two. Three. So that's the easy part. And then you go here. Now, if you can see the background, the best thing is to find a really hot spot to do this. One, two, three. One, two, and three. And then, we, and then you go around the neck. Uh, this usually cracks. Don't worry. It's normal. <laughs> At least for me. <laughs> so it cracks a little bit. There. Then you, get, then you go down. On the ground. So I recommend having a little uh, yoga rug or something. This is going to be a little hard, but get the idea. So you pull your legs up like this. One, two, three. And then you kind of swing it left and right. And you can hear the back crack as well. One, two, three. You know, you see that, how that works. You put your legs down. And you go up. One, two, Three, very useful exercise that one, recommend it. And then you go legs, one, two, three. One, two, three. Try to stay out of the sun so it'll get a sunburn. And then you do a bend on the leg. One, two, three, like that. And another bend on this one, like that. Oh, you put your arms up and then bring them, both of them up. Of course, always, once you get that number down, don't forget three times. Uh, now the thing I can't do, I'm gonna show you, is I usually have a little, like a tube here, and I push down on my leg, like this, on the tube, one, two, three, and then the other leg, one, two, three. And that sort of helps the knees a little bit. I come up, okay. squeeze the under part of the leg here, under the foot, do that, one, two, three, and right, good, and then, switch back like this get this nice little towel highly recommended and this is called the screeching screeching cat position recommend it ah, screeching cat then I go into the folding this is called the folding llama ah. <laughs> very good one two three then here I call this the suspended worm. Worm for now. This is a tricky one because you have to do it three times. Two times three. So one, two, three, and then one, two, three on the suspended worm. And then the old famous, never to be forgotten push-ups. One, two, and three. And then you're up. Out of there. Now the tricky thing is I have to do some squats. I'm gonna do over here. And what I call these butt squats, because you got to move your butt out as far as you can to the back. Two, and then three. You good? And we're getting close to the end, so pay attention. Let me get rid of the towel. Now you do a little balancing. Important as you get old. One, two, three on the left. Bon, one, tu peux lever ta jambe un peu plus haut. Hein. Two, three, right. I get a little help there. One, two, three on the right. Okay. And then the tricky part, you do the old karate kid <laughs> movement. I call this the karate kid <laughs> squat three times. And then one, two, three on that side. And last but not least, now there is another thing I do do is I use some weights to do some um, curls here. 
shoulder, or two, three of the shoulders. And then I use curls that go like this, but I don't have the curls with me. I recommend doing those too. And then to finish it all off, you go down, breathe in through the nose, reach up to the sky, reach to the sea, wherever your, your chakra, your karma is, and then exhale through the mouth. And that's it. Come and join me.